guys, it's Makeup by Yuri, and I'm here to do a look with just my contour palette. Well, an eyeshadow look with just my contour palette. This is the contour palette that you all have been seeing the past three times. And it's the Tan to Deep Contour Palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I'm just trying to challenge myself to see what makeup look I can come up with and see if it'll be a little more pigmented than my last few videos. So, let's roll up our sleeves and get right into it. Now, I've already put primer on, which is this F primer. And I've also already moisturized my face. I did my brows. I like this brow, but not really this brow. But I'm... I'm just going to go ahead and keep working with it because I done tried to fix it like three times already. And like I said, I'm not a guru or anything like that. I just enjoy doing makeup and it's fun to me. So, yeah. So, I'm going to go ahead and get started on my eyes. I'm loud. So, for the first color, I'm going to go in with a, well, with this shade right here, which is kind of my skin tone so I'm going to go in with that shade first you know what you are a little far back let me move forward don't matter my hyperpigmentation it's, it's going to be there regardless so, let me move this mirror. And I'm just putting this shade in my... It's not really my crease, it's just... This, the top part of my eye. And then I'm going to go in with a deeper color. Just to deepen my crease. And I'm going to try to stick with at least three shades. At least three. Now, I know you all have seen me on here quite a, quite a bit. And the things that have brought me back to YouTube is that I quite enjoy it. Now, I'm not the best makeup person on YouTube. We all know that. But I come on here just to kind of get away and to have fun and to, um, I guess, just deal with people outside the house <laughs> now it's my plan to continue to be on youtube I, even after i get i guess done with the homeschooling as for for the school year and all that and even after the quarantine it's still my plan to be on here i just feel like i need to venture outside of the house <laughs> and I want to make friends out there if that makes sense um I am not the kind of person to like get stuck up and to act funny towards people but if there ever comes a time for me to have to stand up for myself I will if that makes sense like I, I have some crazy stories they're not really crazy but for instance one girl hit my little sister and I I was at home I was like what 13 about 14 she was like 6 and they came and they hit my sister and it wasn't even a let me think about it what should I do it was no I ran up to her house to try to fight her and she was bigger than, well she was taller than me not really bigger than me but 
that's one <laughs> that's one thing where I can say like I will defend myself that's not a problem but I really want to like venture outside the house and even if it's on here and be able to talk to people without having any issues and stuff and so that's where the YouTube channel started at and at first it was like an inspirational um, channel which I will still get on here and do inspirational talks that's not a problem I just want to um, what is called I, I just want to make this channel one that somebody can find so I'm trying to stick to like two or one or two things which will be like inspirational talks and makeup and possibly hair every now and then so a lot of people have questions about locks and how to treat them, what products I might use, and those kind of things. So, yeah. Now, I just went in with the darkest contour shade and put it on the outer V of my eye. I'm thinking I want to use either this orange, not this orange, yeah, this orange. Or this shade, but that shade look ashy on camera, but it's not really that ashy. So let's see. Hmm, decisions, decisions. I guess I'm gonna use this orange color. Okay, they don't look bad. It's more, it's gonna be more like an a, um, everyday look rather than the reds, blues, and yellows that I've been having on my channel lately I just hope that I can gain more subscribers um I'm, I'm trying to grow the channel <laughs> not leave it where it's at <laughs> but like I said I think the first video when I came back which was my blue and purple look I had said on that video that Regardless of how many subscribers I get or how many subscribers I have, I'm still going to continue to do YouTube and enjoy it because that's that's what I want to do. Hey, that's what I want. Now, if the views and the subscribers and the likes not that come, that's a bonus. But I'm staying. I'm staying. And yes, I might miss a few videos here and there, which everybody does. Nobody can say that they don't. Nobody can say that they don't. So as long as Eureka is here and my heart is pumping, there'll be videos. Sometimes there will be days that I don't feel like filming. I mean First is today. I didn't feel like filming. I'm not. I'm not even gonna sit here and act like I did. I didn't feel like it, and I didn't. I don't know. Today just wasn't my day at all. Today was not my day. We had school today. My son was acting crazy. He didn't want to act right. And then on top of that, I was just. I don't know. In the middle of me teaching the kids, I ended up getting a headache. So, yeah. My lips look crusty. So, I'm going to take this shade ooh, right here as my highlight shade. And normally I don't do my highlight right now, but it's for the whole eye look, even the highlight part. So, yeah. I need to pluck my eyebrows again. That's probably what's wrong with this, this eyebrow. I was. I need to pluck my eyebrows <laughs> to be totally honest and this I like straight eyebrows so this don't even look really straight or if it do like how can I explain it mm. in the mirror right here that I'm looking at it looks right like it's straight and it's going down the way this one is but this is just like a shorter line it's like this short when this is like more defined that's different but I couldn't really fix it and I wasn't about to continue to try to fix it I was just 
over it. I was over it. Now, I already did this. I'm going to go in with... <laughs> I'm laughing because I'm, I'm lost. I'm not really lost. I'm just... <sighs> like I said, I didn't fight on the video. But I'm doing it anyway. So I'm taking chestnut like I did the last time. This will don't make me look ashy. <laughs> Nobody really said anything, but I was able to tell I looked ashy and I didn't like it. So, yeah. Born this way chestnut. That's what I'm using. I don't want this video to be too long, so. I'm trying to hurry up, you guys. I'm sorry. Now, it's some already on my forehead, so I didn't put them. Well, it's enough. I didn't put too much on my forehead. Because I when I did my top of my brow, no, I did my forehead. So, yeah. Let's try to hurry this up. Now, I might speed this part up, though. And the way I know this more of my shade is because it doesn't take a lot of foundation to cover up my hyperpigmentation. Like it did with the maple. Funny thing about it, Alta was the one who recommended maple. <laughs> That's the crazy part. I got a bump on my, can y'all see that bump on my forehead right here? I'm going to target these bumps. They come out of nowhere. Literally. Literally. Out of nowhere. Ooh. My mirror just keep moving. I'm going to use one more. My beauty blender fell on the floor. Use one more pump. What do you on top of that? But I really want to hear what you guys have to say about the channel. Any recommendations. Like anything. Even if you don't like the video. Let me know. <laughs> so I can figure out the content I should be putting out. Okay. Always keep a wet wipe around to clean everything. Now I'm going to take maple. Put on the back of my hand just like I did chestnut. And dot it across my face. And then with that, here's the other one I was telling you all about. This I woke up like this that I got from uh, Five Below. I'm going to go in here and get my ColourPop concealer. And I just want a taste of it. A small taste. Just a little bit. Because again, this made my face look so ashy. <laughs> it wasn't even funny. Like, so ashy. And I'm going to take the back of my beauty blender. And just blend out these areas.
And I'm gonna take the other side with the foundation still on and just blend it in and go around the edges and blend it in. Blend it in. Mm -hmm. Like that wasn't blending, but it was. Okay, while this is still drying, I'm going to take that contour palette. Oh, my hair gets on my nerves sometimes. I'm just going to take the two dark shades. And contour my face. Yeah, I heard my son. <laughs> Jordan! Can't ever do a video without somebody talking. Especially that one. <laughs> Okay, so I finished contouring my face. Now let me go in with, my, with this blender and blend out my under eye. <laughs> and I don't like my under eye going too far anyway. So, well, you see that, right? You have to clean up my eyeshadow but I'll fix that <laughs> well, my eye my contacts probably got some something in my eye but I don't Okay, and I'm going to take my black opal powder, use a dry sponge for this part. Then I'll take my Sephora, the Sephora, oh, I can't, oh, there you go, Sephora Micro Smooth Powder, and blend in the rest of my makeup. Actually, let me fix my contour. There we go. There we go. I'm just blending all this out. Make sure hmm, your face is all blended. De -de 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 -de. And since this is more of a natural look, honestly, I am just going to line my lips. Oh no. 
Y'all hear my kids? They this all day. Now I just I just had to yell at them, of course. But I'm um finishing my line on my lips. And then all I'm going to do is my lips ashy. I'm going to go in with a nude lipstick. Which is hopefully not too glittery. Because a lot of these MAC lipsticks are glittery. See? Oops. There we go. It's just glittery. Mmm. -hmm. Yeah. See? Very silver. If it was gold, it'd be different. I'm blending this in the best way I can. <laughs> I'm not much I can really do. And then I'm going to take my EOS and dab. Mm-mm. Mm -mm, I don't like that. Nope. Mm -mm. Luckily, my lips are still a little lined. Just a little bit. I'm going to take this pink shade. And I'm going to put this. And then I'm just going to line the top again. Yes. So much better. So much better. Take my Pump It Up Mascara. No. I don't want to do that. I ain't, I ain't set my face yet. While we wait, I mean, <laughs> while I wait to put on mascara, I'm going to do my highlighter. Do I want to? Yeah. I'll do my highlighter. I just use the Patricia Bright highlighter. Should I go overboard? Hmm. Hmm. Today we will, yeah. There we go. Um, you can use the Patricia Bright palettes um, blush also, just to kind of blend out the highlighter too. Don't forget my nose. Don't forget your nose, girl. I need to making those faces, though, for real. I be looking crazy. And y'all don't tell me that I look crazy. Because I know I look crazy. It's okay. It's okay. Now, let's spray our faces. Last and fix. Spray. Hmm. Drench your face in it if you want to. And you'll be okay. Your makeup not going nowhere. It's not okay. It's okay. 
Okay. I'm going to be different today. Look huh. at my dog. You see that? So, these are the what are they called? Liners <laughs> that I have. Hmm, but I I really don't use liner, but I'm going to use it today. Only because it's a natural look and I want to, I guess, look prettier. Yeah. So I'm just going to uh, have one line going across and that's it. That's my liner. Like I said, I didn't mean to put that much that much on. But I I think it's okay. I'm going under my eye with the darkest brown that's in this palette. There we go. I'm just going to use a clean brush. Dust the powder off. I'm going to spray my face one more again. Just to get that powder look from under my eyes. Mm, yeah, I see it. No, that wasn't enough. Okay, why well, keep doing this? Last step is the mascara. Y'all see that? Funny thing about it is I actually have a mole right there. And right here.
again. I don't have to do it again. Move this back. Now, today I'm not going to go and put on an outfit because there's really no point. You can wear this look in something just as simple. As a pullover like this just as simple as this throw some cute earrings like I said I got these from the beauty supply store <laughs> no I didn't I got these from Walmart Walmart jewelry section yes that's where I got these from you can rock these in something just like this yeah, of course take this off my head because you can't I mean you can leave that on if you wanted to but yes I need to retwist my hair. I really do. But you can rock that this look with something just like this. As simple as this. <laughs> and be okay. Completely fine. I like. Let me see. I like this look better. Just like this. Be perfectly fine. Okay. <laughs> You don't have to go all out and look real cute. You go to the store and go grocery shopping. Whatever you got to do, run some errands and be just fine. Of course, you will need a mask. And I haven't learned how to put a mask on my face without it messing up or leaving lines in my makeup. So, I'm still trying to figure that out. Um, I learned from Jackie Ina a way to stop it but I haven't tried it yet so maybe one day I'll come on here out of my makeup do it the way she say do and wear a mask for a certain amount of time like go out and run some errands wear a mask and then come back and show you all the results but I don't know if I'm gonna do that yet so we keep on thinking about that one let me see how this will look with this just a little bit Okay, that toned it down a little bit with the pink. Yeah, a little more pink. Yep, that looks just fine. Um, so again, I thank you all for just sticking it out with me. Thank you for getting me to 83 subscribers. I'm so so appreciative of that um i would just like a little more not not one-on-one -on -one, but a little more conversation here and there so i can know what videos to bring you all make it just a little bit easier to come on and say okay i'm doing this and this how this gonna go and you know just give me a little more leniency i guess i can say Cause this this look came from I just got up one day and I was like, oh, I'm just do my contour palette look, a contour palette look, and this is what I came up with. I actually wanted to do a look with just this palette, cause I really haven't used it yet. Oh, let me cover this mirror up. Like I really haven't used it yet for real. But these are the different colors they have. This the my the Shaney Shaney B Miami palette, and I want to do this palette, but I'm kind of scared because I don't know what colors. I mean, I don't know what look to come up with. And um, yeah. So please stick with me. And again, I thank you for sticking with me because I wasn't here for like four months. That's a whole different situation. My mom had passed. I was sad. I was going through some stuff. It was just crazy. It was it was crazy. But thank you all. And please like, comment, and subscribe. And you all will see me Saturday. <laughs> I have to think about it. Remember I upload Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday. So you all will see me Saturday. Thank you again. 
Talk to you later, loves. Bye.